And now a page from our Sunday Morning Almanac, September 15, 1954, 65 years ago today. The day of a celebrated, albeit very calculated, wardrobe malfunction. For that was the day Marilyn Monroe posed over a New York City subway grate for a memorable scene in the movie The Seven Year Itch. With fans looking on, gusts of made-for-the-movies wind from the trains below repeatedly blew Marilyn's white dress up to unladylike heights. Publicity photos from that pre-dawn shoot are famous worldwide. But crowd noise forced the scene with Tom Yule to be reshot weeks later a on a Hollywood idea. soundstage. Ooh, do you feel the breeze from the subway? Isn't it delicious? Although the scene was intended as a visual gag... Sort of cools the ankles, doesn't it? Monroe's husband at the time, the pinstriped and straight-laced Yankee legend Joe DiMaggio, failed to see the humor, and the scene reputedly played a role in their divorce. Still, that Marilyn Monroe moment lives on to this day, both in the photographs and in the form of a 26-foot-tall statue titled Forever Marilyn.